What up everybody, Marcelian here back at you with another video and this is going to be the answers part. So uh, I'm I picked out 10 questions plus one which will be the winner for uh, Razer Naga Epic. Uh, had a, over 200 questions so it was hard like to answer them all. I just looked through them all and I picked like 10 questions which I liked the most and I thought were the most interesting. So let's get going. First question comes from the user the me Jeff G. How many characters do you have in League of Legends? I uh, don't have a lot, I think like 7 or 8 I bought or maybe more, let's say 10 but the most of them are tanks and uh, AD carries uh, I do have like one support which is Alistair uh, but mostly I play with tanks, I love playing with Shen and uh, Volley Bear so yeah, moving on uh, from the user B Dan Cool. when did you start gaming along with that? what games have you loved since the start? Uh, I started gaming when I was a young retarded fuck. Uh, I think I was like five or six years old. Uh, I had an Atari 2500. Played that. It was a. I remember a boxing game which was all like squares and shit. You know, back then it was fascinating and stuff. But through time, there was a lot of games I loved and shit. Mostly RTSs and RPGs. Uh, I love all the Warcraft titles, I love the Age of Empires titles, SimCity titles, of course Diablo 1, 2. Um, so yeah, too many games I love to, uh, to mention out here, but you know, mostly RTSs and RPGs. Alright, moving on. Next question from Eldron's PP. Hey, mate, at the moment it's very hard for Red Pala to get into RPGs. True, because most groups run with a dot cleave comp. So my question is, do you think Reds will be more viable in RPGs in Mist of Pandaria? P.S. Love you Red Palavids, mate. They're very informative and entertaining. Thank you very much. Mm -hmm. Red Palavids kind of suck in RPGs at the moment. Uh, just because of the lack of the utility. Of course, we can do some damage. We can do some off heals, but <coughs> you're always going to want like more well, like some boomkins in the group. So, yeah. But in Mist of Pandaria, I see things a little bit differently just because Red Paladins are are kind of complete from my point of view like we have slow we have good enough CC we have AOE blind which I think will be really useful in RPGs in Mist of Pandaria we still have good off heals uh, we have uh, good heals for ourselves uh, plus the wings cannot be dispellable we have slow so uh, like in all in all I think Breath Paladins is going to be uh, I think one of the main classes you're going to want in RPGs We'll see, time will tell. If Blizzard won't nerf the shit out of us as they did all the fucking time, we're gonna be okay. Alright, next question comes from Mr. Vigilante97 and he asks, Out of all the games you've played, which game is your favorite and why? Good fucking question. Now, the favorite game of all time for me is on the Super Nintendo. Uh, it's an RPG similar to Final Fantasy and it's called Breath of Fire. It's really awesome. I, you know, I played it a lot. Was a young kid playing it. It really had a huge impact on me. The storyline, the characters, the leveling, all of that shit. The fighting, you know, like kind of turn-based style. Uh, by today's standards, though, I think most of you will think it's shit. But it has a, it, it has a certain feel to it. Uh, you know, which can be described. Uh, if you play it now, probably you won't gonna like it. But that's my favorite game, Breath of Fire. All right, moving on. Uh, what made you think of making this giveaway? And thanks for the chance you gave us, by the way. You're welcome. Now, I want to make this channel grow. And I'm all about giving. So, all the money I make from my monetized uh, videos. By the way, not all my videos are getting accepted to be monetized. I, know why, I don't know why the fuck. But, the money I make from my videos, I want to buy gear and give it out to y'all. Because this way, we can interact. Like, I can, you know, ask you guys to put some questions in. Uh, and also I throw in a prize over there so uh, you get more motivated. In this way you have a prize to win, you can interact, I get more subscribers, more views, make the channel grow so it's a win-win situation. And this is my strategy, I guess, what a fucked up word anyway. So, but I'm gonna do this for like at least the next year. So every time I get like 150, 200 euros from the ads uh, in my videos, I'm gonna buy something. I think the next thing I'm gonna buy is gonna be a keyboard. Okay, so I'm already at 50 euros. I'll need just uh, 50 more, and I can buy a cool keyboard. I'm gonna, I'm not gonna tell you what it is. So uh, be sure to be, uh, you know, active on my channel, and uh, you're gonna have a chance to win it. 
Okay, next question comes from Kunaptor and he asks if you could have one item from any video game, what would it be? That's a fucking hard question, man. I think I would get like the fucking engineer rocket boots in real life to fucking run away from people, slap them and run away with that shit, lift fire over. Or the fucking Gurtalak, the heroic one, you know, just going outside, hitting somebody and then seeing all kind of tentacles come out of the ground. I don't know, man. Uh, but like, it's probably going to be an item from an MMORPG for sure. So, oh no, you know what? I would also get like the Guardian Angel from... Uh, from League of Legends, so when I die, you know, when I die, like when I'm 100 years old and I die, I have the Guardian Angel and shit, so yeah, I, I will get resurrected and still have like, I don't know, 10 more years and shit. Good question. Moving on. Uh, from Cowboy Stewie, uh, when it comes to League of Legends, what is your favorite tank champion and what build do you use in 5v5? Hmm, well my favorite tank champion, I don't know, I'm lingering between Volibear and Shen. Uh, I guess it would be Volley Bear just, be, just because of the extra damage. And my build, well, I think I'm going to do a video about those kind of shit. I don't know if I can tell it right now. But usually Volley Bear, for example, which let's say is my favorite. Volley Bear, you need to have a lot of health. Because uh, if you have a lot of health, your W will hit more harder. Of course, being a tank, you need to have a lot of health. So my build, if it's gear-wise... You know, I get the, the Doran shield, then I uh, slowly get my boots built on into the Warmong and get like three Warmongs, a Frozen Mallet, have good boots and that's about it for my volley. Uh, but I'm gonna make videos about that shit shortly, so stay tuned. Okay, next question comes from Billowman03 and he asks, why do you play a red? I used to play a red in, but I find it very weak versus specific classes combos. Well, my friend, patience is a virtue. Now, I had a lot of patience with the Paladin, and over the expansions, it did got better. Uh, I believe in Cataclysm, it still needed to be worked on, it still needed a lot of fixes, but overall, I think Cataclysm was the best expansion for Reds, period. Excluding the Argent Crusade patch from Lich King, which <laughs> was too OP for Paladins back then. But <clears throat> let me tell you, I played Paladin like from the beginning, like let, not beginning, but from the Burning Crusade. And I played from the times where you would walk in Stormwind and people laugh at you and you know type shit like "lol, pal, get a real class," shit like that. Uh, yes, it is you know weak against comps uh, and different classes, but on the other hand, you got you know you got to look on the other side as well. Uh, some classes do actually fear Paladins, like everybody you know, uh, except mages probably. Uh, everybody, you know, like gets like a fucking scared when they see those wings up. Uh, it's like a natural list. Oh my god, wings, they spell it something to see him. Fuck, oh, damage is coming. So, you know, it depends. Like, talking arenas, if you have like a good comp for red, it can be really nice. It can be really useful. You know, uh, in Cataclysm, reds did really good in arenas. I've seen a lot of, you know, 28, 100, and uh, 3, uh, and 3k, like rank 1 vanguards, rank 1 red. He stayed there a lot as well, so you know you gotta have patience with the red, especially now since like uh, uh, Miss of Pandaria is coming out. Uh, there's a lot of improvement on it. We have a slow fucking, hey, we have a fucking slow. Can you believe that? We asked for that since like Burning Crusade at least, and we got it finally. <coughs> and also, wings will not be dispellable anymore. And we have an AOE blind, and we can have uh, 30 second hammer of justice. It's all in all. Uh, good future for it, so hang on in there, buddy. Okay, next question comes from Cool Zero Zero or Kulu. Uh, when you, <laughs> this is like, <laughs> I love this dude. I, I love those types of questions. So here's the question: When you wake up in the morning, do you piss first or brush your teeth? Oh fuck yeah, I piss first. What the fuck? You want me to explode and shit? I don't give a fuck about my breath if I'm gonna explode in there. Piss first, brush teeth after. That's my fucking rule. Good, good question. Awesome question, dog. Um, and uh, last question from the 10, uh, do you like 9gag.com if you don't try it? I'm gonna answer you this way my friend, so let me just open up my phone over here. Yeah, I ain't no day that goes by that I don't check up my 9gag and have a good laughter on it, so of course I, <laughs> oh shit, sorry about the info, but of course I, uh, I look at 9gag every fucking day. Like even now. So yeah. Okay. And the last question. And the winner of the prize 
is from this guy right here games on iPhone congratulations you won this shit uh, be sure to check your personal messages uh, I'm gonna ask for your info over there and the question is I've noticed you've been quite inactive with WoW any plans on getting back Mr. Romish videos <sighs> yes I do coming back in WoW I started doing PGs again I'm trying to get the fucking good to like normal one and uh, pretty soon I'm gonna do arenas and guides as well so uh, stick onto the channel and you're gonna see a lot of wall footage as well well that's it guys all of the questions congratulations to the winner um, like maybe next month if I get enough money for from the ads I'll buy the keyboard I told you guys about so be sure to be active on the channel you don't want to miss it uh, thanks for watching thanks for all the questions I'm probably gonna answer some more in you know future vlogs keep those likes up in there I really appreciate it all